Welcome back to my channel. I am Kay Gonyama, popularly known as Kay Yams. If you're new here, a very warm welcome to you and a very warm welcome to all my old subscribers. Thank you so much for all the love and support you guys show me constantly. We're so close to 100,000 subscribers, so do the right thing if you haven't please subscribe and get your girl to 100k subscribers okay <laughs> okay cool so as you've seen already by the title of this video i am going to be doing a three in one video i'm going to be giving you guys a story time of how i got this bag and i'm also going to be doing an unboxing of this bag i am also going to be doing uh what's in my louis vuitton neverfull handbag okay <laughs> so yeah okay cool so let me just give you a quick background story as to why i wanted this particular bag and why um and how i got it so the reason why i wanted this bag was because i was carrying this is i'm a big handbag type of girl just in general okay so this is the handbag i was carrying just on a normal occasion this is the handbag i got from um i think it must have been cotton on but i'm generally like a a tote type of handbag type of girl i always have a tote that i'm constantly using on an everyday basis how i use it is i pack my tote bag standard and then i'll carry whatever clutch bag or smaller bag i'm using and just empty the contents inside so you'll always find my tote bag in my car i probably shouldn't say that because so I, I will always have my tote bag in my car and i'll always empty the contents that the things that i need into a smaller handbag just so i never ever feel like i've forgotten things at home or i'm without the things that i so <clears throat> this is the bag that i was carrying and this is how i got the bag um one day i was visiting my my man and um i was carrying this bag and obviously as you can see this bag is getting a little bit old it was a reason to complain so i said to my man oh babe my bag is getting so old please buy me um a new handbag and he was like which one do you want so i showed him a photo and he's like girl you want a louis vuitton bag and i'm just like yeah babe like he was just like you, you like it for real and i was like yeah so he was like okay i'm gonna get it for you so i was just like how can it be that easy but i was like hey okay cool we'll see i mean if he gets it he gets it if he doesn't then he doesn't and it's crazy because at the end of this month i was already planning on buying um this bag for myself you know because i've been waiting <laughs> okay it wasn't that long i mean it was about two months so yeah anyway so i asked him for it and he said he'd get it for me and i think two weeks after that he asked me what color i wanted now initially i wanted the white one but then i realized now in retrospect that it would have been such a bad idea especially because i'm a makeup artist and i'm always wearing makeup and i've seen on youtube a lot of um reviews and unboxing on the white one is that it transfers a lot so if you're wearing denim it will rub on your clothing and you know clothes that have a lot of dye and stuff will stay in the bag so i'm so glad he ended up getting the brown one and not the white one so fast forward about a week and a half after no about a month and a half after he'd asked me which color i wanted he called me up this one day and he's like hey baby where you at what you doing i miss you you know and we'd been fighting so i was like not trying to be nice to him like i was just giving him attitude you know so he's like hey come to the mall with me and i'm like ah i don't really want to come to the mall because you're with your friends and i don't really want to be around them like that so um he then said it was okay and he'd see me later so again then he texted me when he was home and he's like hey i'm home come through so i drove to his place i got there and he pulled up as well so he's carrying as he pulls up he's carrying this paper bag and he's kept carrying a couple of other bags now bear in mind i'm not thinking about this bag anymore like i'm not that i'm not thinking about it anymore but i'm not thinking about it at that moment i'm just but that's not where my mind is at you know i'm just trying to give him attitude for you know whatever shit we were going through at that time so he pulls up with this bag i'm not thinking about it too much and you know he's going on about how much he missed me uh, uh, uh you know and then we go inside we get inside and he's like to me um so he drops all the other bags and he's carrying this bag and he's like to me um babe you know i love you uh, 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 so he gives me this whole speech about how much he loves me how much he cares about me at this point i'm realizing that hi man 
it, this bag may be my this this paper bag may be something for me hey because he's the way he's holding it and he's holding me as well so finally he says to me um this is for you i just got this for you to just show you how much i love you and how much i appreciate having you in my life i'm like for me <laughs> I gave him a spot. I'm like, for me? Are you serious? And he's like, yeah, babe. I'm like, for real, you know? And I literally, I, I swear to God, I was probably screaming for 15 minutes straight. I was screaming. And I was holding this bag and I was just like, ah! Literally the whole time. So anyway, um, long story short, let me just get into the unboxing of this video. That's how I got the bag. My man got it for me. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, when you get the bag, this is the paper bag. It's quite heavy and like quite durable as well. Like it's quite thick. So when you pull out the box, this is um, what the box looked like. It was wrapped in this ribbon for me. It's just a normal Louis Vuitton bag. And then you obviously unwrap <laughs> the ribbon and you put it one side one side one side and this is what the box looks like it's quite flat oh damn oh, okay so it's got like this magnetic thing to it and when you open it that's what it looks like so it has this envelope and it has this um, dust bag, which um, is where the bag is stored. So this is the envelope that it comes with, just written Louis Vuitton. And um, inside it has your um, receipt, I think. It has your receipt and your EFT sort of slip thing and um, basically just says never full M M N M D E B okay I don't I don't I don't even know what that means but um yeah this is all it says I know a lot of people are wondering and I'm not like bragging or anything but i just felt like i mean a lot a lot of people wondering about the price a lot of people asked me about the price of the bag the bag is twenty two thousand two hundred rand not that it really matters because it was a gift but i mean if you are looking to buy this bag then it is quite like important that you know the price really i think it's quite expensive but i really do think that it's a it's worth it i mean as my first this is my first designer handbag and i don't think i could have possibly gotten any other handbag but this bag because of how much of a staple it is also because it comes like it's like a two-in-one bag so it comes with two bags in one so i think that's really cool and really convenient so anyway this is the dust bag that it comes in so this is the bag that you you know a lot of people would ideally like store it in or you know pack it in when traveling or whatever the case may be and then when you open the bag, you pull out the actual handbag. Now, the special thing about my handbag is that it is customized. As you can see, it says K, which is a touch that I didn't know I would love so much. But the fact that he got it personalized for me was just like, oh, babe, you're so sweet. You know, I think that was like really sweet and thoughtful of him also to put K as opposed to a lot of people usually just put their initials like KN. So I love the fact that he put K because it fits and it makes sense. So I really, really love it. So this is the handbag. This is the medium um, never full. As you can see, it's not that big. Um, it's not as big as the GM. I know there's a GM and then there's an MM and I think there's an AM, which is like the smallest one. So this is the medium one, which is a standard one. I think most people get it is in this color and it has a red interior. This is what I meant by it has um, two handbags. It's like two in one. So this is the handbag that it comes in, the little clutch bag that it um, comes in. Again, this also has a red interior, which I really, really like. I'm really glad that he got the red interior as opposed to any other interior. Red is one of my favorite colors. So I also love the fact that it just peeps through. So it's like, a, you know, it has that like, 
you know peekaboo sort of effect to it and you sort of want to see the inside i really think that i enjoy having this bag with a red interior so yeah basically that is the unboxing of the louis vuitton never fall bag and this wristlet sort of situation which you can wear like that you know style with a pair of jeans and whatever or you can just you know wear as a clutch if you're going to the club or whatever you know so i think that's really really cool the fact that she get two bags for one really so i'm gonna be showing you what i usually pack in my handbag so yeah like as you can see it is now um filled it is a bit wrinkled still because it is fairly new i mean i've had it for about seven days yeah seven seven days old today so yeah so usually first things first is my wallet so this is where i have all my cards and some some cash <clears throat> i generally always have a bottle of water in my handbag just in general i also have a pair of shades in my bag because i love 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 shades I also have my makeup bag in my bag, which inside I have... I love the fact that it's red as well, so it looks really, really good in my bag. I do still want an organizer for it, so if you are watching this video and you know where I can get one, please just leave me a comment in the comment section. My, in my makeup bag, I just have my 8-hour cream, some hand cream, I have some perfume, I have um, some powder... I have some lash glue. I have, um, what else do I have in here? Some panty liners as well. Just a few random things. I also have my charger in my bag. I never go anywhere without my charger and the twin plug as well because, child, some people never have, like, I just prefer having the whole thing so I cannot, I can never not charge my phone because I don't have a twin plug. You know what I mean? So I always carry my charger and my twin plug. I have my hairbrush, which I always carry as well. I have my AirPods. I have my asthma pump, which I carry around all the time. I have some gum and um, I would usually have my cell phone as well. So that is what is in my louis vuitton never full handbag okay cool so if i were out and i were carrying this wristlet like sort of clutch bag inside would usually be um just my my, my card some cash in the side um pouch thing and my airpods all the time lash glue all the time um some powder all the time i literally have powder with me all the time and i would then carry this small per smaller perfume um sample type of thing i never ever carry these two bags together because it just doesn't make sense to me um like literally never so yeah that is what is in or what would be in my handbag just on a normal day to day if you do like this video please please give me a huge thumbs up on it thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye